Are you tired of seeing elements on Canva that you absolutely love and then you go to click on it and realize that it's not free? Let's, let's talk about that today. Hey guys, welcome back to Mommy Scribbles. My name is Dawn and I am your virtual writing and publishing coach. I am super excited you are here today. And today I'm going to be showing you a little trick on Canva. Like if you're looking for free images, then um, let's say I type in animals and I type in animals and you see that little crown pro, pro, pro. So that means that if I didn't have pro, I would have to pay for it. But because I have pro, I don't have to pay for it. I could just click on it. Well, oh wait, that's templates. Hold on. If I go to elements, you got to go to elements first. Sorry. Okay. So you're going to go to animals or whatever it is that you're looking for. And so there's a couple free images here, but then there's some pro images. And if you are coming across this and you need to, if you're, if you're creating something for somebody else and you need to use free images, um, what you're going to do, or even if you just want free images on Canva, Canva Pro has the ability to filter free versus pro images. So all I have to do is apply the free filter. And then all it has is free images. Now all that is free, no pro or anything. But if you don't have Canva Pro, there is a trick that you can use for this, okay? So I already typed it in here and I put animals, hold on. I just was playing around with it. Um, ready, hold on. So it's, if you type in brand colon capital B, capital A, capital A, capital M, capital O, lowercase u, J is in well, you know, J. Okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? Capital J, capital H, zero, capital E, and lowercase c. And make sure brand is all lowercase. And it will literally give you all without the filter. Hold on. Let me take the filter off. Hold on. And you'll see. Okay. There we go. There's no filter now. <laughs> um, so now, it gives you literally all free images. So if you are looking for free images that you want to use on Canva and you don't have Canva Pro, because the only way you can filter images is if you have Canva Pro. But if you don't have Canva Pro, like I said, I think I'm being a little redundant, but you just type in this little code here, brand, and then all those letters and, and the one number zero. There's an O and then there's a zero. Um, but if you want to look at something specific like animals, you can type in animals and then the code. And then it will pop up a couple other things, but then you're going to see, look. Oh, what? Oh, no. Now it's giving me, hmm. Well, that didn't work the way that I had planned. Let me see. Dogs brand. Nope. Okay. So that was a little experiment. Um, it looks like those are all pro images. So the only way to do this, the only way to filter things out if you don't have Canva Pro is this code, which is brand colon B-A-A-M-O-U-J-H-0-0. 
E C and make sure you copy it just the way I have it here. I will actually put it in the link in the description box below. And if you want to try out Canva for free, I have a free trial offer that you can click, click the link below and you can have Canva free for 30 days and yeah, give it a try. It is awesome. I love Canva. I use Canva for all of my publishing projects, everything. Canva is the bomb, <laughs> the bomb diggity. <laughs> what, what? Just kidding. So yeah, check it out. I hope this helps you guys. Let me know in the comments below if you already know this trick or if this is new to you. Um, yeah, until next time, keep scribbling. Thank you.